photography is just changing so much right now. You essentially have a camera on every phone, and every phone has effectively, you know, a supercomputer attached to that camera. So the camera team here at Facebook is lighting up this, this new technology that is just now becoming available. Our job is to dream up new experiences and develop the technology to create those new experiences for people. We're always very interested in trying to figure out uh, what kind of experience can work all the way around the world so that people from any corner of the world can share the kinds of memories that they're having, try to share the moments that they're experiencing, and simply to have fun uh, with our technology. The work in our team really occurs at two different levels. Some of them are at a deep algorithmic level. For example, your images and your videos just simply look better. At the other end of the spectrum, you can turn on various effects, like putting masks on your face to be funny and silly and communicate either to those around you or to those across the globe. We're kind of at this uh, time when uh, things are suddenly working uh, in computer vision. This is why the AR VR space is also flourishing. We're just starting, just like really in the beginning, and this is why it's so interesting to be in the field. Facebook has, has two billion users that, that use our, our app at least once a month, and they are sharing billions of photos a day. No one else has that scale. So just analyzing such massive collections requires a new type of computer vision techniques that uh, we're developing. There's this impression out there that now that we have machine learning, now that we have artificial intelligence, the computers are just going to figure all this stuff out automatically. But it's, that's not the case at all. It's great to have sort of understanding machine learning, but that's just a tool. You also have to have understanding of the basic problem that you're trying to, to solve. So, for example, trying to get the device to understand what's out in front of your camera, to see, oh, that's a face, or that's a landscape. That's very difficult, actually. It's only in the last few years that we've been able to do that. If we can uh, teach computers how to see like we do, it will create ways to experience our lives that we didn't even imagine. It's easy to take a photo, but making a great photo is, is a lot of work. When our software is running on your phone, it's always going to help you express visually what you want to express in that moment. And it's just going to amplify your ability to share what you're seeing in the world. I think that's what our mission is. That's, that's what we're trying to do.